What's up guys, my name is Chris Kane and welcome to Let's Play Turtle Head. So I remember checking this game out on Tumblr uh, and come to find out that it was unfinished at the time, but it looked interesting. I don't remember what this game's about, but uh, I was told by uh, a fan of, um, I don't know if it's your real name, if you're okay with me saying your real name, I'm just going to call you Bernie, for letting me know that this game exists and it is finished. So it's supposed to be a pretty short game, so let's check it out. It looks really weird. I like that. Yeah, just in case you don't know. Come on, guys. Pick up the pace, why don't you? Give it a rest, Emma. We're not supposed to be here anyway. Yeah, yeah, if you don't want to come, then just go home already, Mason. So Mason and Emma. Then who would be around to stop you from getting arrested? Oh, I think this is the game that I saw that it was like kids go into an abandoned warehouse or a mansion or something. You worry too much. Try being a little bit more adventurous. Okay. Yeah, it had cool art too, I remember. Well, here we are. The atmosphere sure is a whole lot different here at night. I don't know. This place looks pretty, like, well lit. Why are all the lights still on? It's nearly midnight. Midnight, that's a good observation. The janitor's supposed to be in here... Supposed to be here in about an hour. I guess it's it's there for their benefit. What the hell, Emma? You never said anything about that. Calm down, would you? We won't even be here that long. I swear, if we haven't dragged Harriet into this well, I'd leave, I'd leave you to get yourself in trouble. Whatever, I didn't force you either of you to come. But I did call you guys, like, cowards if you didn't. Such a child. Alright, let's just get this over with. Why... What was so important you had to sneak into the school so late to do this? What better time than try to photograph a go oh, okay. Try to get pictures of ghosts. I'm pretty sure the school is haunted. I had a feeling that this has something to do with that dumb rumor. I'll search upstairs, Mason. You can check out the halls to the right. Harriet, you look around the entrance wall, keeping a lookout for the front, front door for us. Now you're just ignoring me. If anyone spots any signs of a ghost, call me right away. What a pain. Say, Harriet, you've been fiddling around with something in your pocket since we got here. Something wrong? I see. Is it, was he a mute? I won't pry if you don't want me to. Anyways, I think it's about time we got started. I don't know what Emma's thinking, but we could get into some serious crap if we're caught. Try to be cautious if you're going to look around, Harriet. Alright, so we're Harriet. I didn't expect to play this character. Jeez, alright. It's a random crack in the wall. Alright, you were really fa Oh yeah, I did turn dashing on, because I'm, I'm tired of... Uh, I'm tired of games that make you hold the button down when there are no chase sequences, but apparently this game does. So, yeah. Door's locked. Fire extinguisher. Is the item for the secret ending in here? I just got done playing Imaginary Friends, and there, apparently in order to get the best ending in that game, you have to do secret stuff that you wouldn't know unless you looked it up later. Or just happen to find it and know and knew what to do. That's weird. But still, I got a pretty good, um, pretty good uh, ending anyway. Okay, it's October. It's probably Halloween right now. Maybe. Happy birthday, Dale. Wonder if that has any plot significance or anything. Ah, we don't care. It's a dark. Wait, is this the first floor we're at? There's the stairs to the basement. Very quiet. Something's written here. Memo to Dale. The combination has to be entered as... Guessing month and day. Shouldn't be hard to remember your own birthday. Wow, that was, that's pretty easy. Ah, uh, uh, okay. I, I don't know. I gotta look at that again. Uh, it, was, it probably is 1024? No, it was 26. Okay. <laughs> Pretty simple uh, combination lock. So 1026. It's 
my birthday. I got the office key. How do you save? It's... Wait, we play as a girl. Huh. Sorry to any girls who are named Harriet. I, I didn't know that there were girls named Harriet. Oh, well, we got Harriet Tubman. Never mind. You alright? Oh, hey, Harriet. Say, you don't actually believe in any of Emma's nonsense, do you? I know that people have seen some strange things around here recently, but I still think it's silly to say that there's a ghost around. Guess either way, we better hurry up so we can get out of here. It's probably no ghosts. <laughs> What's in the basement? I'm curious. Probably can't get in. It's locked. This key won't open it. Can I look at the key? Key to the school offices. Oh, this is what Harriet was fiddling in her pocket. Come to the school tonight. I'll show you my favorite flower. Who sent you that armor? D -d -d -d. You know, I kind of like it that there's no music. Some Sometimes... Some soundtracks of games can get a little annoying. I have to admit. It, did you duck to see if there are any legs in there? No? Okay. We're not allowed in here. <laughs> we'll go in here anyway. But there's an X here. You can see something on the ground inside the stall, but it's too far for you to reach with your hands. Just... Man, fuck those people who, like, lock those and like crawl underneath so that people can't get a, get in there. I got the hallway key. That's the cafeteria. Alright. We got some important items so we can just save. Let me do it one more time, just in case. It's a whipping sound. Mason's searching that area. We should not bother him. Alright then. Uh, yeah, there was a door here. Does the key go away? Yes, it does. Good. So I don't get confused as to what, uh, whatever. Something written here. Even after all those months, I can see that student is still suffering. The students are still suffering, but how could they not? The police still have no leads and haven't made any progress in their investigations. What, hap what happened has completely shaken this community, even if the one responsible were to... Or to be brought to justice tomorrow. I feel that is already too late and that the worst has already happened. This must have happened recently. Like, I bet they're ghosts. Why? Well, I don't know. But it seemed for them to have notes of this just out makes it seem like you know, can we leave? No. Makes it seem like uh this happened like the other day. Okay, we used the hallway key, and it went away. Okay. We need another key, though. Always with the keys with you. I can see something. <laughs> what if we just keep staring at him? <laughs> Are you for real? Oh, we can't do it anymore. That's crazy. Wait, what? Uh-oh. There's nothing there now. But you did see something, right? Hey, Harriet, where are you? Say something. Oh, you never say anything. You can hear Emma shouting. But where? There you are, Harry. I've been looking all over for you. Unfortunately, I couldn't find anything. I wish we could stay a little longer, but Mason probably won't. Probably throw another fit. Let's go find him and go home. Somebody with reason in these kind of games. Ah, this is dumb. Let's just go home. But yes, this is like a. Uh, obviously, this game is an inspiration of like Auni, which is a game people have totally. Like a hundred percent of the time is one of their suggestions for me to play, and that game is so well known. I've seen it multiple times. It's cool. I 
don't believe this. The chains are all, all around the handles. Wait, who did that? You sure Mason went through here earlier? That idiot's trying to prank me out. This is a pretty crazy prank. I'll go around from upstairs and see if I can find him. Let's go together. Or not, we'll just split up. Just wait for us outside. I'm sure it'll only take a second. It's pretty concerning that they're using chains. Well then. I don't like this at all. So I'm just supposed to wait outside? Well, that's not it. Door won't open. You can see that there are chains on the outside, too. Oh, that's a cool effect. Oh, the lights went out. That's concerning. It went out everywhere. I like this already. I should go find my friend right now. Son of a bitch. Project Turtlehead. Even though this game's called Turtlehead, it's called Project Turtlehead. Shit. The room is small and completely pitch black. There's no point in searching there without a light source. There's a little, little bit of a light source in here, though. Please tell me you can read. Okay, good. Oh, it's too dark. I can't read. If you wait long enough, your eyes will adjust to it and see it. The other day, when I was getting ready to leave, I spotted an unfamiliar man standing at the end of the hall. I didn't get a good look at him as he was so far away, but the instant his head turned towards me, he took off running. Of course, I gave chase, but I lost track of that guy fast. I let the other faculty know about it, and we called the police. Unfortunately, they couldn't find him after a long search of the area. I don't know what he was doing here, but I find the most troubling was that when I saw him, he was standing outside of Miss Lily's classroom as if he had just come out of it. None of us know if this incident has anything to do with what happened uh, earlier this year or if it was just a coincidence. Either way, I'm going to be more alert from now on. These are really private documents that are just sitting out. I find that kind of weird. But that's alright. This is a fun little game. Yeah, thank God there's nothing in these lockers as far as I know. The desk drawer is locked. Cabinet is filled with a few books. No weapon? No? Nothing? Crowbar? Nothing? A giant yardstick? There is a wire tied around the doorknob. I need scissors. Can't use the fire extinguisher. Oh, that's a good sound. See, that's why it's good to sometimes have silence in games, so that when a sound does happen, it fucking takes you by surprise. Are you f- <laughs> Just leave! Oh shit. What do I do? Oh fuck. Wait. What am I- I'm dead. That's a creepy looking enemy. Well then, uh... What do you do in a situation like that? Oh, I just realized he's wearing a mask. He's not actually like a mutant. You are not a mutant. You're not real. Fuck, what are you supposed to do? D Shit. Yeah, I, I don't know. I assume that you could hide in the lockers, but, I, like, he, he goes so fast. Oh, someone's crying in there. Okay, you have to... You just have to figure it out. Yeah, he's wearing like a mask. I'm 
Okay. <laughs> These are really good sound effects. Very much like uh, White Day, too. Got a desk key. For a desk, I don't know. One of them was locked, I know. Uh, yeah, so you have to run... Oh, I'll show it in the video. Never mind. I don't have to explain everything. I show it through my actions, as everyone should. Was it this desk? What do we got? There's a battery in the desk. There's also some documents in the drawer. I can't believe they're delaying the demolition again. Don't they know how dangerous that place is? It's been years since the school used to... School used that old building, but I can't understand why it's taking so long to get rid of it. I'm seriously worried about one of these days some students will sneak in there and get hurt. Although it's not like the current building is that much better. Oh, is this an older school? No, no, they didn't imply that. They implied this is the school they go to. Never mind. I think. Oh. All right, let's save again. We can do it, Harriet. Wow. Are you all right, bro? He isn't moving. Is he breathing? That's not important. I'll just take this key and leave. Also, I noticed this too. I have, I have batteries. Are you kidding? What? Am I coming out at the wrong angle? Oh, it needs two batteries. Okay, never mind. I guess if I'm am hurt, although that guy killed me in one hit though. <laughs> Harry, I thank God you're all right. You saw him, right? The man in the mask? And what he did to Mason. We need to get out of here now. What, the exit sealed off? What were we supposed to do then? You look for another way out? But the man is still wandering around. It's too dangerous. But I guess there isn't anything we can do about it. I'm sorry, I wanted to go with you, but I'm afraid to go back there. I'll hide in here while you try to find a way out. So you used to be the one that goes, I'll do it myself. Now I've become that person. At the very least, if we have no weapons, we could arm ourselves with a like a with the computer, like like it's dead rising or something. But I guess not. Handles are chained, so forget it. I need two batteries. Uh what did I pick up again? Classroom key. So just look for a classroom that's locked. What's up here? Oh, never mind. That didn't take long. What's this? It's a chalkboard. Oh, pointer. Okay, I thought it was a painter. That was a chalkboard painter. There's a lot to read here. There have been a lot of rumors among the students lately. Supposedly, during the late hours of the night, people have claimed to see an alley shaped figure standing at some of the windows. In addition to that, some of them have even said that you can hear the sounds of someone screaming from inside. Of course, at first, I didn't believe any of this. It was likely that everyone was just scared and paranoid after everything that has happened. But now I really don't know what to think. The other day I was having a drink with Sam. He told me that when he was driving home from his graveyard ship that night before, he saw someone standing at the window of the top floor of the school. Sam has always been the no nonsense type, and I don't doubt what he says. And considering the time he says he saw this, there shouldn't have been anyone in the building uh, not even the custodian. Uh, what if Sam w saw wasn't just his mind playing tricks on him? Then, does that mean that there actually have been someone wandering around the school every night? But if that's true, then what the hell are those sounds people have been hearing? Ah, uh, but I'm not going to believe it. I saw the chalkboard. Oh, I know what to use for that, I think. Not exactly what I expected to use, but... Uh, 
Let's let's explore this. Fuck. Maybe we shouldn't explore this area actually. That's the library. There's blood there. Hold on a minute. Maybe the item we're about to get is what we need up here. So I just have to find the bathroom again. Okay, here we go. So there was something here. Using the chalkboard pointer, you were able to reach for what was on the floor. It's a screwdriver. Now I'm lost as to where I would need a screwdriver. All right, you know what? Let's just explore up here. Maybe we need the screwdriver up here. I don't know. Was this unlocked? Before? Yeah, it was. Never mind. All right, let's save real quick. All right. Use the classroom key. <laughs> Alright. It's nothing of use, but what's in this bloody sh bloody uh, drawer? You can just make out the shape of a key in the darkness. You managed to reach the key. I got a bloody key. I bet Turtlehead won't appreciate that. Also, what's the key for? Teacher's Lounge. I'm glad it actually lists like where it's for. What's going on over here, though? All right. Oh, I don't need the classroom key anymore. Piece of paper sticking out between some of the books. Gotcha. I gotcha, buddy. I, I see you. Nothing else going on in that room? What is this? Oh, that's what the sound is. I unscrewed the back of the radio. I got a... Ooh, I got a battery. Good. Expecting more chasing, but not yet. All right, 